Hello guys, welcome back to another video. Before talking about the video, would like to wish everyone a happy new year in advance. This is our last video of 2021 and remember one thing guys, life is too short so dream big and make the most out of 2022. Wishing you all health, wealth and happiness in the new year ahead. So once again, happy new year to our small tech family. Okay, so now let's talk about the video. So in this video, we'll be covering Pixel Experience ROM for OnePlus 60. Pixel Experience ROM is currently present for OnePlus 60, but it's not present for OnePlus 6 right now. You guys can keep a track on our collection of custom ROMs based on Android 12 to check out the development on custom ROMs for your particular device. And thank you so much guys for completing the like target of 400 likes on our previous video. Let's keep the same like target and also let's keep a 100k subscribers target in 2022. So if you guys are new to this channel, it's a humble request do consider subscribing and also press the bell icon to get notified whenever we upload a new video. So here I have my OnePlus 60 on which I am running Pixel Experience ROM based on Android 12. Let me show you the software information first. Here you can see Android version is Android 12, security patch is of 5th November 2021. If you guys wish to install Pixel Experience on your OnePlus 60, then I'll leave the installation guide at the end of this video. You guys can follow the video guide of installation and install Pixel Experience on your OnePlus 60. Pixel Experience based on Android 12 also comes with few goodies of Pixel devices. And we'll take a look at those things in a bit. These are the benchmark results with single core device have scored 497 and with multi core device have scored 2027. With Antutu benchmark application device have scored 4,2316. With no doubt you guys can use this ROM as a daily driver. Only one thing which I found is missing on this Pixel Experience based on Android 12 is ability to unlock the device using fingerprint unlock. So currently FOD is not present on Pixel Experience ROM. And you'll also not get the support of face unlock. To secure your device, you have options like swipe, pattern, pin or password. ROM comes with its own launcher which is Pixel Experience launcher. And here under wallpaper and styles, Monet is fully present. And also best part is, we also get these Bloom wallpapers from Pixel devices. So these wallpapers can be customized as per your requirement where you can see, you can adjust the blur effect and these are also motion wallpapers. So if you move your device, you can see bit of motion in the wallpapers. Also, if you're using Pixel Experience ROM, we get the ability to copy images from the recent panel. For example, here you can see we have an image. Soon you open an image, you'll get an icon to copy the image. Tapping on it will give you a few options. Either you save it on your device, share or copy. And the same thing also happens with URLs. So if you have any tab open in the recent panel, you'll get an option to share the URL also. And these are some exclusive features from Pixel devices, which you can also enjoy it on other devices if you have Pixel Experience ROM. By default, you guys won't get the Google camera application pre-installed. We have this basic AOSP camera pre-installed. But you guys can find the APK of Google camera in the description below and use that Google camera APK. For me, this particular APK of Google camera works fine on my OnePlus 60. I'll also provide you guys the XML file. But depending on your taste, you guys can try different XML to get better results. Basic functionalities like calling works fine, though we don't get the option to record calls in the stock dialer. While using alert slider, we don't get the icon sometimes, but alert slider also works fine. Charging speed is similar to stock Oxygen OS. And the battery backup is also good enough. I've been getting 3.5 hours to 4 hours of screen on time. Being such an old device and I haven't replaced the battery of my OnePlus 60. Did not see any kind of issues with the sensors like accelerometer, light, proximity, magnetometer, compass and gyroscope. All the sensors are doing great. On custom rooms, most users are worried about whether they'll be able to use the payment services or not. So here, you won't have any kind of issues with the payment services. If you go to Play Store and check the Play Protect certification, it says device is certified. This room also passes the safety net check. So as said, you won't have any kind of issues using payment services. Did not even see any kind of issues with Wi-Fi, hotspot or Bluetooth. Adaptive brightness is well calibrated. Also, you won't have any kind of issues using always on display. And this is how always on display looks on Pixel Experience ROM. And here we have the Pixel feature which is Live Translate. This feature can detect other languages and show you the translation based on your language. Quite a handy feature and non-Pixel users must try this feature for once. We have the privacy dashboard of Android 12. And if you go under security section, here you'll get to know the risk on your device. For example, here you can see it says set a screen lock because I personally don't use my device with screen lock. And if you tap on other two warning, it says you have security recommendation. 
secure your account in the security checkup. So this feature is also quite handy to secure your Google account. For me, off-screen gestures doesn't seem to be working like double tap to wake or double tap to sleep. Google's gaming dashboard is present on this custom room, which can let you record screen, monitor FPS data, and guys, we'll be doing a dedicated gaming test on Pixel Experience Roam, so stay tuned for that. With no doubt, you guys can use Pixel Experience as a daily driver on your OnePlus 60. We only have few things which aren't working like fingerprint unlock and face unlock. But overall, quite a stable Roam, and I personally don't have any kind of complaints with it. And now let's talk about the installation process. So before installing, make sure you have taken the entire backup of your device and also make sure you are running the latest build of Oxygen OS on your OnePlus 60. After that, your device bootloader should be unlocked. So here you can see our device is OnePlus 60. Under device state, it says unlocked. And later, we just need two files. One is the recovery file and the second one is Pixel Experience Room. Also, download latest platform tools. All the download links can be found in the description below. Once you download platform tools, unzip platform tools and if you want there you can create a subfolder. For example, I have many devices so I have created a subfolder for my OnePlus 60 and here I have placed the recovery file. Now first thing is we need to boot a device into recovery which is TWRP recovery. So for that open up command prompt in the platform tool where you have placed the recovery file. Type CMD in the address bar and hit enter. So here command prompt opened up and now we need to check whether a device is properly connected in fast boot mode or not by giving command fast boot devices and hit enter. This should show you the serial number that means your device is properly connected in fast boot mode. Next step is to flash the custom recovery. So for that give a command fast boot flash boot and followed by the recovery name. You can right click and copy the name or just drag and drop the recovery file in the command prompt. Later hit enter. If you don't get any error, that means we have successfully flashed the TWRP recovery on our OnePlus 60. Now go to your device, use the volume key and when you see recovery mode on the top, hit power button. Now our device will boot into TWRP recovery. So as you can see, a device booted successfully into TWRP recovery. Now next step is to copy the pixel experience room and place it inside the internal storage of your device. Paste it here. Once the ROM is copied successfully inside the internal storage, go to install and flash this ROM. Swipe to confirm flash. Flashing process might take around 5 to 6 minutes. After ROM is flashed successfully, go back to the recovery main page, tap on wipe, select format data, type yes and hit this blue tick mark. Once done, just tap on reboot system and our device should boot into pixel experience based on Android 12. There you can see we have the boot animation of Pixel Experience Room. And finally our device booted up. Just complete the initial setup and you are good to go. So guys, this was a quick look on Pixel Experience based on Android 12 for OnePlus 60 along with the installation guide. If you still have any kind of questions, you can drop me a message on Instagram or Telegram. Once again, Happy New Year to everyone. As of now, only this much in this video. I hope you guys like the video. If you like the video, then do give me a thumbs up. And also if you are new to our channel, then do not forget to subscribe the channel. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.